I'm Abhishek. I'm from Mumbai, India and a current computer science student at Graduate School of Arts and Sciences. Today, I'll be taking you on a tour of the Computing and Data Sciences building, which just does not house the Computer Science Department, but also the Mathematical and Statistics Department, as well as the Computing and Data Science Departments. So, let's go! So, the CDS is a 19-storey tall building which houses multiple classrooms, eating joints, and student studying areas. I will be taking you through a few of them. Behind me, you can see Saxby's, which is one of the eating joints that I'd like to visit. Not just to get a grilled cheese, but also a lot of coffee. Hey, you're back. Let me take you to the 14th floor, where there are a lot of student lounges and study area where I like to just hang out sometimes when I'm not in a class. Growing up. So, this is the 14th floor of the CDS building. This is one of the student lounges right here. And if you see, the view is breathtaking. Well, now that you've seen the view, if you're into social media and don't know what to send your friends, that's one thing you can send for sure. Come on. Moving on, this space hosts a lot of offices for professors and a lot of study space for students as well. Let me just get my jacket off. This is one of the study spaces where a lot of our students like to just hang out and talk with their friends or work on a project together. Interesting, right? Moving on. You can see on the right a lot of offices which host some of our professors, research students, and also master students at time. Going through it, there's a small hangout spot here. You can get your coffee from here if you are yeah, you know, just in the mood for coffee or need a morning shot to wake up. <laughs> now, who doesn't like to hang out on couches or sofas? This is another student study spot or just to lounge and relax after a long day. Sometimes if you are having meetings, you might want to have a neutral background or just an empty spot. This is the perfect space for that. I've had a lot of my meetings right here. Carrying on to the final spot that I find the most interesting are the sitting desks where a lot of students like to spend time just studying. Well, now let me take you down to the second floor where we host our Spark Innovation Center as well as a lot more study area. Hey everybody! So today, I'm going to be talking with the Operations Director of Spark, Lydia. Would you like to introduce Spark? Oh, great. Hi. Um, yeah, so my name is Lydia. I'm the Operations Director. Uh, BU Spark is the kind of experiential learning arm of CDS. So we provide um, real projects for students to work on in courses. We also have a branch where students are bringing their own ideas and um, we're actually seeing those to fruition. So getting them, getting them out. Some of them even go to market afterwards. So we really try to um, create an opportunity for students to get hands-on learning um, to prepare them for the real world. So Spark is not a place where we just host projects, but they also teach students in classes as to how to go about building software, not just from the bottom of where you come from the engineering principles of it or the technical principles of it, but also managing the project and building upon what you have created. Moving on, let me show you all the layered stairs that we have here. It's one of the best spots to sit. Oh, by the way, if you're just hungry and want to grab a quick bite, we have a grab and go on the fifth floor as Terrier Bites. Well, that brings us to the end of our tour. And so let's exit the CDS building. And I hope you had a nice time looking around the Computing and Data Sciences building as much as I had a nice time showing it around. Goodbye.